today I am going out. I've got a couple things that I need to do. Um, I want to see if I can get some 120 film and shoot my first roll of 120 film. I'm gonna go and try to use this for the first time. Other than that, I have my Pentax A1000SE. Um, this I got from my mom uh, forever ago. I've been shooting on this since high school. She got it when she was in high school. And I currently have a roll in here that I am just slowly using. Just while I'm out and about, uh, take some photos with this. Up till now, have really enjoyed just capturing moments um, with my friends and interpersonal relationships. Whereas I'd like to try and take more artistic photos um, of architecture and just where I am because I have this mindset of only using the film when I am traveling or um, going on a trip or something and capturing the moments from that trip with the people that I'm there with but I really wanna see if I can capture here at my house and um, in my yard and in my town and stuff like that. Can't keep my hands to myself. You're my metaphorical champion next to you and the juice. I did in fact get my Kodak 120 film, but the thing is, I did not read the fact that it quite literally says right here, 620 film. Cut and shave this down to fit it because it does not fit. I'm loading up my camera, at least I'm gonna try to. I have the instructions pulled up here. Okay, so. I started to clip this off, but because I'm using 120 film in 620, I have to clip this. Online said nail clippers, but these aren't the best pair. That's what it's looking like. I think I found the way to do it. Clipping it, right? Like grabbing on and then rolling it and it just like falls right off. Nail file, film. I'll be back once this is filed. This needs to be in here. Hooked it into the thing. I'm gonna give the winding knob two or three turns. One, two. All right. It says close the camera back. Secure it. Okay, it's closed. Turn the film wind knob until figure one appears in the center of the red window. I'm pretty positive there's supposed to be an arrow that appears. Ah, arrow. I think we're ready. I think it's time to go take photos. All right, we're gonna go take some photos today around the area. Today is a very beautiful day. I don't know what I'm gonna take photos of, but I wanna get better at my film. And I think today's a good day to try to figure out composition, stuff like that, because I don't think I'm going to like the color of the film that I'm shooting with. We're going to cross our fingers and see what happens, okay? Let's get in the car and go. Very, one of his movies. Yeah. And all during like only candlelight. 
Yeah, and I think they only had 500 ASA film or 250 ASA film at the time. So yeah, that sounds about right. They too. needed like he yeah so he, he wanted a very fast that. lens. He was also very interested in optics in general. But so my understanding um, is that he talked to Zeiss about having. Starbucks coffee cup. But I think it's just gonna fly away. I'll save that for another time. Um, I wanna go down there, so. I don't have much time to talk because I think my camera's gonna die. But apparently, I'm at the end of this and I'm at the end of this. So I've used up all the film. Um, so I don't think I have any at home. So I think I'm gonna go and get these developed. I was only able to get like one, maybe two photos out of it. Okay, Pentax, I gotta rewind. Got this button down here on the bottom. Okay. You press that. Pull up this little lever, there's an arrow, and you just spin it that way, so. That doesn't, that's okay. So I'm just gonna do this. Basically, when you take the photos, everything starts over here, goes across, and rolls up on here. But, if you were to just open up the thing, then all your film gets exposed. So then you put it into reverse and wind it back into the canister uh, and that way you can safely remove it without any issue. And then once you hear like these clicks, I'll, I'll get close so you can hear it, that's, it's like, meaning there's just like a tail out and it's just spinning so it should be safe to take out, but listen. that noise so then what you do is you pull up and it pops open and then you can take it out there we go now I go and get this uh, developed and I can put new film in Close the back, close that, we're good. Now I gotta look this up. I've got the owner's manual on my phone. Googled it. Well, first I tried to find on TikTok and TikTok just showed people taking it out. So then I Googled it and a Reddit thing popped up saying that I don't need to rewind anything and I just remove the film and then transfer that original spool to become the next take up spool. So I think I can just keep winding and I'll be okay. Okay. Please. 
these work? <laughs> Goodness. Fold under before sealing. Okay, there's this paper here. All right. Roll it. Fold under before sealing. Okay, folding, folding, folding. Okay. Do I lick it? Am I supposed to lick it? Do I lick it? I think I lick it. My camera just died. Just, but I licked it and I sealed it up. So this should be my first roll of 120 film. There's stuff in this from Michigan. How long have I had this film in here for? Car. That's a good shot of Raleigh. Okay. All right. I like this one a lot. I think I can brighten these up. And then these will be really cool. Oh, I like this of Paige. Okay, on here, it's looking good. Hold on, Raleigh's calling. Okay, slightly different angle because whatever. I love this photo. Like, it's just like in the corner and oh, I like the coloration. I think that's such a good photo of Raleigh. Meyer? It's okay. All right, I took this to Pittsburgh. Look at my bestie, look at my friend. Daddy's my friend. My name is Cassie. She's my friend. Okay, just sort of walking. This is so stupid, but I love this. It's my Starbucks. I actually really like this photo. I like the composition. I like the the tones. I like that it's like so cool. And then there's like the red. I was moving. So I don't hate it. I like this. I like this one actually a lot. I'm really proud of these. I love this. Disappointed I missed the train. But I'm happy with this. I was worried I was gonna hate all of these. Okay. I decided to go with this Tri-X 400 film. Uh, it is a black and white Kodak professional film. I like black and white photos. Um, that's what I started taking film as was black and white um, at school to develop it. So my lens is kind of gross, but we're just gonna shoot with it. And <laughs> crank photo. So with that, we're set to start taking photos. My ISO is in this window here, and I have it set to 400. I almost always just keep it on 400 because I usually don't shoot with anything else. We'll use my light meter that's on my phone, set it, and then twist for it to focus. 